ready for today? Oh, Stacy, Barbie is always ready. I am ready. A little nervous, but ready. Well, your cap and gown are ready for today. I can't believe my little girl is actually graduating. Feels like yesterday when you took your first baby steps. Aw, Dad. Well, Barbie, you're gonna give the class speech? Aren't you nervous to speak in front of hundreds of people? A little, but I have been practicing. All right, let's eat breakfast. Mom made oatmeal and a special graduation breakfast for you, Barbie. Okay, here's a plate. We have a ham and cheese omelet for Barbie. Yum! Some sausage links and yummy waffles. Some scrambled eggs, toast, and bacon for Skipper. Banana oatmeal for Stacy with some strawberries and a side of sausage. And Chelsea just wanted scrambled eggs and toast and a little chocolate muffin. Well, enjoy breakfast. Thank you so much, Mom. Guys, I completely forgot. We have to pump gas in the car. So uh, everybody, let's kind of hurry. I... Okay, I just have to go brush my teeth really quick. I just cannot be late, you guys. Okay, everyone, let's go. We'll finish breakfast later. Okay, I'll go brush my teeth. I just have to get my camera so I can record the whole graduation. I'll just sit here and wait. Let me put on my cap and gown and go. It's open. Barbie, Daddy said we really have to go. Come on, let's go. All right, guys, let's go. There is a gas station right here. We'll pump gas real quick and we'll be in your graduation in no time. Okay, Dad. All right. Now we wait. We're on our way. What happened, Dad? Oh no, honey, it's a tire. Oh no! Okay, I suspect it. Okay, not to worry. We have one in the trunk and I can change it. No, we don't, George. We used it for my car last month. Mom, Dad, I have to go to my ceremony for my graduation. I am the, the speaker. We're already late and... Where's my phone? I left my phone at home. I need to tell somebody that we're late. Don't worry, sweetie. I'm gonna make a quick phone call to my friend Josh. He'll be here in no time. He'll help us with the tire. Oh no, poor Barbie. We're gonna miss her graduation. Where's Barbie? I've been trying to call her and she's not picking up. It's not like her to be late for anything. I don't know, guys. I'm getting worried. Especially since she's doing her speech. We need to tell the principal that she needs to wait for her. Where is Ms. Roberts? We need to start. We need to start the ceremony. Principal Clark, we should probably give her a few more minutes. Absolutely, she is never late. This will not look good in her college application. Look at the diplomas. I can't believe we're graduating, you guys. I can't wait. Guys, what was one of your favorite memories of this school year? For me, it was a science fair. That's so true, Teresa. That was so much fun. I'm so nervous for the science fair presentation. My stomach is starting to hurt. It will be okay, Nikki. I have to remember the right order to make the volcano erupt correctly. Very impressive, Miss Teresa. Thank you, my dear Volcano, for doing exactly what you were supposed to. Incredible experiment. Great job, Teresa. For our second place, it goes to Miss Teresa. My Volcano, second place? Me? And my Volcano, second place? <laughs> Thank you, everyone. I can't believe it. <laughs> Great job, guys. And My favorite memory was actually our school dance. It was so fun. I agree. That was really, really fun. Especially because I got to dance with Barbie. Hi, right, guys. I'm going to slow it down a little bit for all you cute little couples. Everything is going perfect. We were able to raise so much money for the art department and everyone's so happy. Hey. Hey. Um, do you want to dance? I'd love to. Guys, look! The Roberts are here! There she is, you guys! She's here! Emma's already here! And I see some seats available for us. Come on! 
Barbie finally made it! Excuse me, excuse me, can we squeeze in there for a second? It's a little tight in there. We're here, everything's gonna be okay. Thank you, Dad. We are all so proud of you, Barbie. Barbie! She's here! Barbie, yay! Hello, Miss Roberts, go on. <clears throat> well, I can't believe we're here. This school year has really just flown by, but there are some valuable things that I have learned that I wanna share with my friends. And I had a clear lesson of that today. No matter how much you plan things, sometimes things do not work out. But it's all about how you react to those things. If you choose to work hard and move forward, all your dreams will come true. No matter how many obstacles stand in the way, I have learned so much from each and one of my friends and teachers, as well as my family. But one thing I wanna tell my class today is, if you have a dream and you work really hard, the sky is the limit. You can be anything. And I can't wait to see what the future holds for all of us. Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! That's our bestie! Go Barbie! Beautiful speech, Ms. Roberts. And now I may present each of you with your diploma. Ms. Barbie Roberts. Thank you very much. Daisy! Woohoo! Daisy! Yeah! Teresa. Thank you. Nikki. Nikki, congratulations. Thank you. Mr. Ken Carson. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> we had an incredible school year. Keep watching to see some of our best school moments. Uh, hey Nikki, can I talk to you for a little bit? Sure, Ken, I was just here reading a little magazine and having a quick snack. It's about the school dance. If you're gonna ask me it's too late, I already said yes to Jackson. Uh, that wasn't it. <laughs> I know, I'm just kidding. Do you think it would be weird if maybe I ask, um... I ask... Ask Barbie to go with you? How did you know I was gonna say that? Look, Ken, everybody knows you have the biggest crush on Barbie. Everybody except Barbie, okay? Uh, really? It's that obvious? Oh, please. Do you know if she feels the same way? I mean, we're like best friends. I don't want things to get weird. Look, Ken, the best advice I can give you is to actually talk to her. It's better than wondering what she'll say. Okay, I'll see if I can get the courage to do so. Good luck, Ken. <sighs> I don't know what to do. Skipper, can you believe the dance is this weekend and nobody has asked me? I was 100% sure Chad would ask me. There he is at the library. But he never did. Oh, come on, Leah. It's gonna be totally fun. It doesn't matter if you have a date or not. How about we go together? It's best friends. It will be so much fun. Yeah, totally. <laughs> Thank you, Skipper. I feel much better about going to the dance now. Chad is totally missing out. Oh, I totally forgot. I told Jordan I would go to the dance with him. <sighs> what am I gonna do? Oh, my friends are over there. Barbie, everybody is pumped about the school dance. I know, I'm so excited. I think we should all go together. Well, the ones that don't have dates. Uh, that sounds like a good idea. <clears throat> we need some extra hands setting up for the dance, so if you guys are free, I would really appreciate you guys coming tomorrow night. I'll be there. Me too. Count me in. Where's my book? Oh great, Barbie's in her locker. What is Bryce doing here? Oh. Hey. Oh, <laughs> hey Bryce. So, school dance this weekend, huh? Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm in the dance committee, so we're trying our best to make everything really festive for the whole school. Are you coming? The ticket sales will be benefiting the art department. I don't know yet. Dances are not really my thing, but um, I was thinking if maybe you would wanna go together. Oh, great, she's gonna go with him. I should have had the courage to ask her earlier. Now it's too late. Oh, wow, Bryce, I'm really, really flattered that you wanted to go to the dance with me, but, but since I'm in charge of the dance, I'm gonna be all over the place and probably won't have much time to hang out. But thank you for thinking of me. Oh, wow, okay, shut down. Um, I'll see you around. I hope he didn't take that the wrong way. Hey, can I talk to you? Sure. I kinda have two dates for the dance. I told Jordan I would go with him, and then I told Leah I would go with her. 
What am I supposed to do? Well, you've got more dates than I do. I would just be honest. You can never go wrong with honesty. Tell them both the situation and there'll be plenty of time for all of you guys to hang out in the dance. You're right. I don't know why I'm stressing. Thanks, Barbie. <laughs> You're welcome. Wow, this turned out amazing! A couple of balloons and some string really just subbed the party. Do you want to help me with this one? Sure. Okay, that's the best I can do. Thank you so much for helping out, Ken. I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, of course. I'm gonna go finish up the photo section. Oh, that's right. Thank you. We're gonna have a great time. Okay, maybe I was wrong. You guys did good. I told you everything would be perfect, Tammy. Now it's time to have some fun. People are starting to arrive. Okay, guys. Smile! Okay, whoever wants to take a picture, you can go right ahead and step up. Alright guys, I'm gonna slow it down a little bit for all you cute little couples. Hey, Leah, do you want to dance? Hi, I didn't know you were coming. I know I had a basketball game, but I'm here now. Sure, let's dance. Well, that pizza was good. Um, do you want to dance? Sure. I'm not gonna lie, this feels kind of awkward. I'm not really a slow dancer. Me neither, but I think we look good. Well, it's a good time to get some hot dogs since everyone else is dancing. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Everything is going perfect. We were able to raise so much money for the art department and everyone's so happy. Hey. Hey. Um, do you want to dance? I'd love to. 